Biden is now considering draining the already depleted U.S. weapons stockpile for Ukraine. This is a time when they should really be waking up, not worrying about pronouns, and thinking about defense of the United States of America and pulling in some of their forces to protect themselves from what they very really know is coming very shortly. But they're doing the opposite, which tells you it's planned. President Joe Biden may send more American weapons and ammunition to Ukraine, even though Congress is stalling additional funding to replace them. Depleting American stockpiles in order to support Ukraine would anger Republicans who believe Biden has to prioritize the defense of the United States first. Senator Jack Reed, DRI, who serves as the chairman of the Senate Armed Services Committee, told the New York Times that the idea was on the table. The Defense Department has around $4 billion authorized to send to Ukraine from their own stockpiles. But the Pentagon remains reluctant to use that without a reassurance that it will get replaced. It won't. Earlier this month, Marine Corps Lieutenant General Carsten Heckel raised concerns of the armed service ability to replenish stockpiles while assisting Ukraine. The Senate passed a $95 billion foreign aid package earlier this month, just printing money the whole time, which includes $60 billion for Ukraine. Zelensky's already ordered his new Porsche. But Republican Speaker Mike Johnson remains reluctant to bring it to the floor, citing the need for President Biden to confront the crisis on the southern border first. America first, your crisis first, your people living on the streets and homeless and jobless first, the drug problem with fentanyl first, the issues with crime and lawlessness first, all the chaos reigning in America first. First, all of the chaos on the southern border. First, no, no, no. Biden, a new ice cream flavor and all the money to Ukraine. See how planned this takedown of America is. We see what's going on because we are awake, because we're reading our Bibles, because we see all the signs of the times. Keep spreading the gospel. Keep sharing the love of Jesus Christ and keep looking up. Shalom.